G'day guys, it's Jake here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to enable Telnet so in Windows 10. So by default, Telnet's not enabled. If I go D, you'll see Telnet is not a recognised is not recognised an internal or external command. So that would mean that Telnet's not installed. If it comes up and says what I show you later. Um, and looks like it does something, that means it's already installed and you don't need to install it. But at the moment it's not installed. So to install Telnet, right click on the Start menu and go Programs and Features. In here you'll see this thing, Turn Windows Features On or Off. So click that button, scroll down and find Telnet Client. Tick that, hit OK. It will make the changes it needs to make. So now, if we type in Telnet, you see that Telnet's actually enabled. So you can tell that it is in Telnet because it goes, Welcome to Microsoft Telnet Client. The escaped character is Control plus this little close bracket thing, and it tells you that you're inside the Telnet Client. So if you hit Control close, oh, it doesn't work. Control C should it? Oh. So quit works. So to exit Telnet, type in quit. That control with the little bracket thing doesn't actually exit it. So Telnet to start Telnet. Then you can do to wherever you want. So say and dot com twenty five. So there's just telnetting into mail.bigpond.com and as you can see it's logged into an SMTP server so if you wanted to send an SMTP through telnet you could but I'm not going to. And there we go. So that was basically how to install telnet on Windows 10. If you have any questions or comments leave them down below and I'll see you next time.